There are times I believed I was a joke. I was so ass broke. Going through all these stressful situations, all I saw my were limitations. I was having all these physical symptoms without knowing the failure of my mental systems. You see, I needed to get out of my head. The first step was to get out of the bed. Off I went out the door to go out and explore. I found that during my walks out there, it became easier to think in here with care. So I went further on this path, this trek, and with the sun beating down my neck, I took comfort in shade to contemplate the life choices I've made. Sitting underneath this big oak tree, on the ground, I found an oak nut, a little seed, an acorn, you see. I pondered how something so small could grow into something so strong. Could I have been wrong? The leaps I wanted to make starts with the small steps I needed to take. Even though I felt small, I matter. Causing my limiting beliefs to shatter. Broke was a temporary instance. Poor was a state of existence. Often I felt behind because I hadn't shifted my mind. Wealth. It's a state of being. Aware of our mind, body, soul, living fully in our life's goal. Man. Wait, humans. Create your plan. Free yourself from debt and despair, not solely on credit repair. Grow your net worth. Believe in your self-worth. Allow money to flow, not through a spreadsheet of deprivation or drawn out deliberation. Flow with intention, because life is best lived with purposeful direction. Ding. Do you hear that chime? My time is coming to a close, so let me end with a little more lyrical prose. Time is not money. Money is printed. Time is limited. Time is the most valuable resource you possess. Become obsessed. Be willing to save and spend that dime and learn to value your time. Because life isn't about sacrifice and sadness. Life is sacrifice and choosing happiness. Underneath this big oak tree, I found a little acorn within me. I realized my life with no small joke. And at that moment, I woke. I want to thank you very much um, because writing, speaking is one skill. I didn't realize poetry was a different one and that was my first attempt uh, at writing and I've been able to fortunately be able to perform it. And for, for me to be able to share this part of me, I hope it uh, plants a little seed in you uh, as well. And that is kind of like the message of hope and happiness. And I hope that hearing my experience provides a bit of hope for you because I'm a big believer. Hope is hearing other people's experiences, me hearing your experiences, you hearing mine, that we are providing each other hope. And, and so with that said, it's like my goal is to get as many people to become financially well. It's not simply about achieving a financial number because most more of you doing financially well, we get to live in a better world. And, and so that has been my mission and that is why I align myself with the organizations that I do align myself with. When I have the opportunity to pick the work that I do, the people I work with, and when I work, you know, we have a really busy schedule. And, but for me, it touches my, my heart, touches my soul when I meet people um, who are passionate about shifting the trajectory of their life and wanting to also impact other people's well-being. So again, I want to thank you so much. I'm not sure how we are with time. I know I did promise to read the preface. Um, and I can certainly do that. It's, it's, it's a few minutes. And the only reason why...